Hello everybody, welcome in. I am the Shadow. We got a lot to talk about today. A lot to talk about today. Oh boy. Uh, the uh, Every year, the uh, Sheriff's Department, uh, they have a big conference in Washington, D.C. to discuss what is going on in our country and uh, how to uh, help each other uh, in law enforcement and how to work together. And they discuss the uh, crimes that are going on in the country. Well, they had this meeting this year from February 3rd to February 6th. And uh, during that meeting, the sheriffs were told by the FBI uh, director, Christopher Ray, that a threat uh, exists and that an imminent attack on America was imminent, uh, that it was going to happen. So after the conference, one of the sheriffs came back home to his state and county. Uh, he's uh, from Ohio, this sheriff was. And he immediately uh, put out a press release uh, to his county, to his constituents in his county, the citizens of his county. And he stated and told his county that a threat upon America exist and that the threat of attack was imminent and would occur in America. He also, after putting out that press release, uh, went back to his department to the sheriff's office and proceeded to uh, make sure that all of his uh, deputies, sheriff deputies, were armed properly with AR-15s. Now, also during this press conference, uh, the FBI uh, revealed to the sheriffs that these Chinese hackers uh, were continuing to... Uh, try to infiltrate the infrastructure in America, the water infrastructure, uh, the power grid, and so forth. That was all um, put out uh, to the sheriffs. So now, buckle up, people. 2024 is going to be one heck of a ride. So buckle up and load up on supplies and lock your doors. Lock your doors on your house and your windows. Secure your property. Secure your property and Lock and load. Now, on the deal with everything going on overseas, as you can see, the Middle East has turned into um, a very disturbing sight, okay, with a lot of things going on over there that are extremely um, bad. It's all bad, okay? All right, and uh, we see what's happening over there uh, and what's going on in Israel right now. Um, they put out a emergency notice to their civilian population over there to basically get supplies uh, because they felt that there was a 
imminent threat coming on their northern border. So they put out that to the public, telling them to get supplies, to get food, water, medical kit, flashlights, and um, so forth, and to have those supplies in their homes, okay? After doing so, um, the stores over there were inundated by civilians buying goods for their homes. And also 30,000 people got up and left the country of Israel. Uh, so that's going on, okay? We also have NATO. The NATO, the head admiral of NATO put out a warning to the NATO countries that they need to be prepared and prepare their citizens to have food, water, first aid kits, dry goods, and flashlight and flashlight batteries, a way to see, and a way to heat their home without electricity. Now, this was put out by NATO, a admiral over the whole NATO fleet. And this came out about two weeks ago. Things are escalating, people. Things are escalating every day. And we've had these countries overseas. Um, Germany, Poland, uh, the UK, uh, Sweden. Uh, all, all these countries have come out now and... They're preparing their people of their country, telling them to get supplies to prepare for the W, okay? So, but nobody's telling you, uh, the people of America, okay? Wonder why. Wonder why that is. Uh, anybody got an idea about that? Huh? I'd really like to know, okay? Uh, but uh, we must be resolved in what we do now. All Americans must be resolved in what we do now. Okay? And what we need to do is we need to prepare. Prepare um, in case of bad storms. In case of um, earthquakes, uh, we need to prepare for those things that uh, may or could occur, uh, you know. So, uh, we need to start preparing for those storms, those storms that might come. So, please prepare. Uh, put up canned food, water, get a first aid kit, get dry goods, okay? Uh, you know, have a way to protect yourself and secure your home and property. Also, make sure you have blankets and sleeping bags so that if for some reason the electricity would go off, uh, or the propane would be shut off to your home that heats your home, that you have a way to have light in your house and to have heat in your house. So these are things that you need to be doing right now. You need to be loading up, loading up on supplies to put in your home. And you be, need to be locking down your home. Secure your home and property. These are things that you must do right now uh, and uh, to prepare for that storm that may come. Uh, these are things that we must do. So <clears throat> lock and load, lock and load, buckle up people. Because it's going to be a wild ride 
in 2024. I am the shadow. Like, share, and subscribe.